Welcome to week number three of the Night Lord Progression series, where we take this Night Lord from the muck to the slime. All right, so here we go. What happened this week? Well, for starters, I am now level 271, so that's freaking cool. Uh, and it really wasn't like an insane amount of grinding, it just happened to happen from doing dailies and this and that. So, you know, kind of daily story, but there's like a little bit of grinding thrown in between, maybe like an hour or so every other day. So we're not like burning ourselves out or nothing. Um, so that was pretty awesome, 271. Slowly getting up to our 285 mark at some point, we will push for that. Um, I don't know how long that's going to take, maybe a year. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. But you know what? Long-term goals, right? And so the next thing I want to talk about, which is probably a little bit more hype, honestly, is that we got an arcane box to drop this week. So I immediately exchanged it for the gloves, and here they are. I've been working on them a little bit. Um, I put, you know what, I actually think I got a really good RNG with these gloves, because not only did the box drop, but I went and I bought like a bunch of cubes, and I thought it was going to be like over a billion to get it to legendary and then even more so to get to crit li a, a crit line and then like some other useful line. And all that shit happened in 600 or so million. So it really was not bad at all. And I'm like very happy with that so far. Like that's crazy. Um, hopefully the good luck continues on these gloves eventually when I start star forcing them. Um, and yeah, so that's where we're at. And which leads us to the next topic here, which is actually kind of important, and it's going to dictate what happens the next couple of weeks here. So now that we got our gloves, um, that really frees up a lot of these coins. I have nine coins already, like, made or whatever, and then I have nine more droplets. So for all intents and purposes, let's say I have 18 coins, right? I need 24 for the weapon, as you guys know, and that means... It's, it could happen in two weeks. Like, if I get three coins this reset and then three coins the following reset on the hard lucid runs, then it's it's going to happen. I just need to get the meso now. So now it's not a matter of fact of, like, oh, like, does he have the coins or does he not have the coins? Now it's like, oh, I need the meso to exchange these droplets into coins. And I kind of ran some loose numbers in my head and I think I need like 7.8 7.9 8 billion something like that Let, let's just round up to let's say 8 billion meso let's, so I need 8 billion meso in order to exchange all of the droplets into actual coins um, and that'll put me at um, you know the, the 24 coin mark that I need and then you know, I actually don't even know how much meso I have. Let's let's go find out together. I don't think I have that much, honestly. I didn't really do that much this week. And I've been kind of studying because of midterms. So let's find out. Let's see where we're at. Oh, please, tell me it's a lot. Ugh, okay. Lame. Only sitting at three bill. I mean, it's to be expected. I haven't really put any work this week. So, yeah, three billion meso is kind of what I'm sitting at. And, you know... I need to get to at least 8 billion, so that's another, I get 5 billion a week, mind you, like, easily, like, without grinding, just strictly doing daily bosses, um, like, Ursus, my weekly bosses on both this character and my Zero, and I'm sitting at, like, 4.9 billion, just casual, like, casual daily story level shit, so it's not bad, right, so I'll definitely have 8 billion next week, and then I'll have one more week or so to farm as much as I can in preparation for the weapon so that I can start cubing it um, immediately and then maybe get it to like at least 15 stars, I think. I don't think I want to push to 17 until an event, but I don't know. We'll kind of see how it goes, how much mess so I can accrue in the next two, three weeks. So keep an eye out for that. But for sure, once I start cubing it, I'm going to make a video about it. Like we're cubing, we're going to save up a couple billion and then just fucking cube and have a little old school cubing session. Um, I'm very excited for that. Um, and then the last thing I want to talk about before my next class starts in a couple of minutes here um, is I forgot to mention my hexa stuff, like my hexa stat, my hexa whatever. Um, so we're sitting here. Let's just open the hexa matrix here. So let's start with the hexa stat. 
And this was like the first thing that I did um, when I got to six job, besides obviously get like your origin and stuff. Um, and like a couple of points in your hexa quad star. Um, I just started doing this because I thought it was kind of cool. I like the RNG aspect of it. And I like gambling. So I was like, fuck it, let's do it. Um, so I seven, seven, six, you know, not great. I, you know, I've seen some better ones, but I've also seen some worse ones. So I think honestly, this is kind of like middle of the road to middle good. Maybe, maybe not. I don't, I'm not sure. Maybe that's just me coping with what I got, but I don't plan on changing it anytime soon. So, you know, just, just doing, just doing what we got to do with this and making do. And then, um, our hexa skills. So we got our origin to six. I don't know why it's at six. Honestly, I should have just kept it at one. It's strictly just a <laughs> iframe at this point for Night Lords. It does very little damage. I don't know why the fuck I put six points into it, but you know what? You live and learn. Um, and then we got our throwing star to level 25, so we finally were able to level this thing up uh, in the Hexa Matrix. And we got the throwing throw blasting to level 5. Um, now this is the thing that really costs the most costs 175 frags to go from 19 to 20. Um, it's, that's a lot. Honestly, that is a lot. And it's going to take at least a week to grind that much frags. Cause I don't, I don't sit and wop a day every day. Like some people do, like some people do like two, three wops a day. A number one, they have no life and no job. I don't know how the fuck they do that. And B, like, that's mind-numbingly ass. Like, I could never do that. I'm way too busy for that shit. So there's no possible way I'm going to get 175 frags this week. Um, maybe by the end of next week. And that would be hype because that, that would be a nice little part to the next video or the next or two videos from now, I suppose, where it's like, oh, look, we got our shit to level 20. Oh, well, cool. Uh, <laughs> so that's kind of where we're at. Um, Legion stayed the same. And, yeah, thanks for watching. This is... Week number three, next week I can't believe is going to be fourth week. So that means we're gonna, we've are gonna we been doing this for a month. And we're still going strong, slowly making gains. I'm just so happy about the, the arcane this week. And hopefully, um, if we're lucky, we can get another one. You know, but for now, I think that was good. And it gives us something to work towards for future weeks and future videos. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.